bread it there for everybody to come back to our home. That's, that's just my mindset. I want to learn to do things for myself. 
I want to be an all-rounded entrepreneur. Okay? Oh, cool. So you can hit up Chopper Studios. You have an expert name, designed by Jay. He's very affordable as well. Bear mind, all these people I'm missing, the prices are between like three five to five grand. Like them, them are over the end expense. Like they're very affordable. If you are like really low on cash, I'm going to tell you some free apps to start your business. You know? Free free apps. So you have Canva. I think Canva is available on Android, but I know it's definitely on iPhone. So if you want to do flyers, you want to do labels, if you want to do those simply graphics for your business, Canva is one of the top notch ones to use. And it's a free app. So you can go, ahead, go over there and do your thing. I'm going to show you something that I did on Canva. If I still have it. I'm just going to insert the clips. I did that on Canva and I went to a print sheet in Harper Tree and I paid like a hundred dollars for ten on it. And that would be like one dollar for ten in a US print. So yeah. So ensure that you need no good graphic. Make sure that the presentation of your product is absolutely wonderful. So like I'm not saying that if you have a Samsung you can't start with this. That is stupid. Learn how to use apps. I'm going to give you a bonus. Face tune is the app to edit your picture. You edit your personal picture of your face, you must try it for your business. Like it's definitely the app. So, when you do your market research, if you get a graphic designing, you have to become vegan. Like most businesses in Jamaica, they're operating for like let's say 10 years and they're not doing stuff. So, my business right here, which is Authentic Skin and Hair Care by Kim. She's been registered. She, um, it's almost two years since it's registered. So go over there and shop with us. The first step to register business in Jamaica is pretty easy. To me, it's an easy, easy process. You don't use online. I don't recommend you use online. Let's, let's physically go there. Like, oh, after COVID, it'll be better. So what you're going to do, you're going to need your passport, your TRN, your birth paper, and three potential business name for your business. So the process is between three to three to five business days. Your three to five business days is your name that you selected is successful. So when I went and I registered my business, my business which is other skin and hair care by Kim, it was known as King's Natural Skin. So if you are a real OG, just comment down below and say OG. They know they are long time ago on Instagram. When I went there, they were like, okay, you have all the documents, you select a business name. You can do a research. I think it's a scan like thing to see if any other business have a name like yours. But I never wanted that because in person you have to pay. And if I know me, I know say I'm a little cheap. <laughs> So I didn't pay, I didn't want to pay, so I went ahead and I'm like, Kim's Natural Beauty, like nobody else is out there do have that name and I've seen that name on Instagram and I that, so nobody has that name. Little did I know that the way they do it is that once somebody has the name Kim, Beauty or Natural or, or two of those names or words in their business name, I can't do this. So even the person register and they'll pay no tax or no oh, I cannot get that business name. I need to do that. But that's how they do it. So I had to go ahead and change my business name so I didn't have to give them three alternatives, which is authentic skin and hair care by Kim, authentic products by Kim, cosmetic products or something like that by Kim. But at the time I was really upset to mail us to anyone and they just said authentic because your product is going to branch off into something you want so I went ahead that. Big up a lady. Big you up and see. And she did, fun fact, she ended up bought products from me like the day that I was supposed to come and pick up my documents. She ordered some products. Really old. You have to go ahead and register this in Jamaica. Why should you register your business in Jamaica? Like, people are like, all governments are going to tax me. Why? Why? The best privilege of all, the best privilege of all. Oh, you get to go down by custom and collect things when people don't want. Be able to go down a custom to take things that people don't want. 
at on the low low. So let's say the price come and then buy one fabric softener for thirty dollars and customer charge me for six thousand dollars. Then my mother want it, customer just want get it out of the way, customer sell it for thousand dollars. That is the benefit. And the, the whole COVID-19 thing, I think if you were paying tax, the government did give back some money for your business, so that's a plus. Um, persons trust you and realize that you're not just a little, oh, I'm an entrepreneur. No, they realize that you're serious, so you're thinking long term about the business to go ahead and register, so they're more support. Because nowadays, it may be thrown away, but nowadays, everybody is opening an online. E-commerce has become so fun name, a fun name, presumptuous, I wonder where they need It has all there. Every day somebody posting, follow my friend's business page, follow my friend's business page, coming to school. So for persons to trust them, realize that you're actually in for the long term, you're not just a seasonal entrepreneur. But we have a lot of seasonal entrepreneurs, especially now. COVID-19 revealed all of the seasonal entrepreneurs. All of who make masks, all of who make sanitizers, they're seasonal entrepreneurs. Because after COVID, I know they'll be, they, they be selling that. Just, just think. So when you're in the same business, they make people actually want to buy from you. They make them to say, you're ready for the, you're ready, you're ready for the world. And you need to create a platform, whether a website, like Instagram, WhatsApp, you do some. You know, you have to just create a platform to show the your product or service that you're offering. I went ahead and I used Instagram because at the time Instagram was just basically it wasn't no e-commerce. Bear in mind I started my business in 2017. So them time that Instagram never had no e-commerce. Instagram was an IG girl who posted Post IG book. Ruby's Sky Della Demo for there like it was no e-commerce. So I used Instagram as an e-commerce platform. WhatsApp, I use every now and then because we are choosing from WhatsApp, you know, you have selective amount of people can watch your stuff. So, people don't really buy from you from WhatsApp, but they use it as a platform to communicate with the customer after they place their order on Instagram. Or, if you have top notch money, you know, say, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that business here, I'm gonna leave that business here, that business here, gonna be a legacy, you can go ahead with a website. I tried the whole website thing, but I'm in Jamaica and the old payment something never did our work. So I I would recommend it in a way that was even more with what's in on this. So if we're gonna go over the steps to start the business, you have to do your market research that includes finding a supplier or finding a niche that has a leak edge. Then you're going to get your graphic design in. Yeah, the graphic design in there, you know, to take your pictures, you know, to edit, and then you go ahead and you work of the benefits attached to register your business and then create a platform to showcase the product or service that you do. What to expect when you just got that or ask your parents What most persons don't know is that the support from persons that you actually know will be very 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 don't expect that because they know a father I'm not just Bob to work. <laughs> they are expect because they know Bob from the animal go to basic school, Bob is going to support you. Bob rather buy from Versace than from you, the small school. It's just the reality of life. Like, let, let, let's expect that with this. And it's not going to be easy. That's the second one. It's not going to be easy. Yes, I know that you see people on Instagram, they like, they, they have got them whole catalog of products going out for delivery. Don't be fooled. They actually put in the work to reach that stage. Like, don't think that oh, when I go in the industry, that is what I'm going to expect on my first month, on my first week. You just have to go. Not even the first year you make your money because men do not look at I made my first hundred k must the last year too. I'm almost done with this business. And last year, June was 29, so that was two years. Two years of hard work. In the state of and in the US, that is 10,000 US dollars. So that is basically like the people that is working. So don't expect to say you have to make money right now. You may be one of the lucky few that as a start, they must have home. If that's you, girl, go and go do this. Leave you up. 
the third one customers will be a no show you will have people who will text you and be like oh i want a product today i'm really excited for a good one this i'm gonna like address today what size you have you have those type of persons but it's not something that can be avoided because even currently i'm experiencing that so it's not something that can be avoided but eventually it will be it will, be, it will become like nothing to you when people show up customers will kill you customers will turn off phone fire you a little mini story time in 2019 a customer place so i'm big order with me but well in a big again to me but back then it had be big to me came over my start of what is the night in one day place that order for a big remember the other now on big kester on big coconut oil and on flat seed chain back then that would have been like more more two five marks see now past two five and she said to me i call her before i left home because me usually work out places to do one delivery which which me not recommend because men do it one delivery for the day like merging but if the person available that day alone go ahead and do those stuff you want to do so i call her and i'm like hi this is kim i should you before right now so i'll be there shortly she's like okay no problem kim and i say you're in new kingston right and she said yes so i'm like okay and i came home from the r n with the other day i go after the color time money and go buy the kfc after from there back then and even now sometimes why is it like a little more than half a bag? Half a And that, that is a problem, but we're going to talk about it later on. So, you know? so I reached New Kingston now and I'm calling and I'm going to say, Hi, it's Kim, I'm at the location. Dial to one. Hi. Maybe I'm not credit done, but we did not tell me not to send my credit done. So then I'm going to call her, I'm going to call her, I'm going to call her. She finally answered and she said, Oh, I'm coming to you right now. So I said, Okay. But then I didn't know where exactly she was, but it's. No, say at that plaza in the kitchen. So now, when I can't say the car, I'm ready like about 10 minutes now. And I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do a quick run. From Fort Morgan, after she go back and go back to the gate, she go back and go. But then I call, 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 go on the plaza and ask for, we're not seeing her name. Go up on the plaza and ask Patricia. So I'm gonna go every every shop I'm gonna knock. I'm gonna say Patricia work here. Cause Patricia never tell me where exactly she work. Patricia will say she work on the plaza. I'm gonna say Patricia is here. I'm saying no, the friend named Patricia. I'm gonna say I didn't know where it is. I'm gonna say about the dressmaker place. I'm gonna say Patricia work here. She say Patricia, Patricia work on that little smoothie place around here. So walk around here. Just in the corner and you walk. So walk around here. Going on the stair. I'm gonna do it. So um. The young lady greeted me and she's like, hi, good afternoon, thank you for meeting that so and so. So I'm like, hi, I'm here to Patricia. She's like, okay, I'm going to call Patricia for you. Patricia see me, Patricia say, hello, how may I help you? Never mind, the lady don't tell Patricia, say, Patricia, this is the girl that like, says she'll pick up, say, when you do the transaction. Patricia said, how may I help you? So I said, um, I'm here to deliver the products to you. I called you when I was leaving for her. Patricia said, she don't have it. So I said, well, you may don't have any money. But she's like, you don't have any money. So I said, Patricia, my child's are taxi for cover. Yeah, she did it. I just wanted Patricia to just fit the item. I just wanted to see her to see that, you know, like, have little conscience. Take the, take the package there. Just take them. Means a trying girl. Just take the package there. Patricia said, how much is that for your own dollar? Angela, I'm going to put you on the back of the chest. I'm going to put you on the back of the chest. I'm going to put you on the back of the chest. I'm going to put you on the back of the chest. I'm going to put you on the back of the chest. I'm going to put you on the back of the chest. I'm going to put you on the and Malaya, I said, Patricia cannot see us. Patricia cannot see us. There's no way I got to Patricia see us. Like, even right now, I said, I got air water come on my eye. Patricia don't see us. So I'm going to video. I'm going to say, Oh, you have to do this. Malaya, I said, Oh, you have to do this. 
So that one thing, I am currently, I'm still learning to separate when the bad things happen and I put it up on my page. And later, my friend is going to be like, Anyways, somebody told me that it's best to just block, block her from a black country shop. So when people don't show up, guys, oh, I'm gone too far, more like a story. When Patricia did that, when I reached home, somebody called and ordered the same exact package of Patricia ordered, and they came there with the mom's story. So I did not have to be. If it's for you, it's for you. And sometimes when things happen, you gotta have a better way to work. So when customers don't show up, and I have to tell myself sometimes, sometimes it's for you. It's like an African on the first part, even up to the last part, but sometimes it's like And the last one, where I think the, the one that most people are using this for is to make money. When you just start, baby girl. When you just start, don't be fooled because Chase is a you have a lot of cash in, in, in your possession, you feel like you have money. You have to like you try to sit down and work on everything. So if you're gonna sell clothes, you have to work on say okay, I bought this suit of clothes from the supplier for one thousand five hundred. Times that by two, three thousand dollars, the shipping fee, which would have been like I don't know based on the shipping company, but I know my five hundred just a packet. The product will end up cost three thousand five hundred. When you make that three five good it don't think say your property is 3-5, your, your property is not 3-5 really now. Your property is not 3-5. Remember you have to pay back the supplier, but you have to buy back more stuff. The fact the way you make, it's, it can be smart, but instead you buy one the next time. And then the $500 amount, you need to slow down a little bit. $500 amount, you need to slow down a little bit. Sometimes you think that you start a business and you have make money with it When you sell your work on the cost of production and all of that. So you have to like sit down and realize say, you can't be money driven all the time. You have to be passionate about what you do. And to be smart, if you have if you time to buy it too and you add your shipping fee, does you have all of the money? And stuff. And so the next stuff comes, you split money in half. Or you take out 10% for yourself. Now, as an entrepreneur, I always remember to pay yourself. But once you don't pay yourself, you're not going to feel driven and passionate about you. And don't overpay yourself, girl. Don't do it. You know what's supposed to only get 1,500. Don't eat 2,500. Don't overpay yourself. Don't look at my crystal. I'm going to know somebody what me and tell them said, don't. How to keep it successful, especially during COVID-19 and after COVID-19. Be consistent. Like, when I will come and be all, oh, if I have 30 days of content, I was following this business page and be like, oh, you need 30 days of content, you need to interact with customers. When you fake those 30 days of content, like you push yourself to do them 30 days and it now work for you, supposed to be a fast foolishness, people realize. People see through how you post. People know if you're genuine, people make you say. The saddest thing you do on the media, support will decrease or increase. And as time support will increase or decrease based on how you portray yourself on the media. So let's be consistent. So in the morning, if you wait 10 o'clock, it is at 10 o'clock, I'm post what I have in stock. Then, when I support me, I can't. Instagram, like in your story, post what you have in stock. Then, maybe do a little trivia question to the customer to engage them. Don't just make it only be a thing when they're close, 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 close. Engage them. They want to know you as the customer. People buy from people that they feel like they might engage. So, engage with the customer. Be consistent. Bring different content. It's like you can always enter the bread market because there's just like bread on the shelf. But at the end of the day, what makes you choose a national bread over a wholesale bread? You need to make your brand stand out. If you sell clothes and tea, you can't just post a little picture of them after AliExpress or after Wusha or whatever you get your products. 
like that is so basic and people want to feel people want to watch the video and feel good people want to be like oh my life would sit down for her like when she turn sideways and see her back but i like the realness of the picture and you have to get that from here you have to you have to just be different if you're sending something be different you have to just be different if you're sending something be different and don't watch anybody else because that man will start the same time as you, but that man's success will take off. And you'll be like, man, stop because being success will take off. But in the end, stop, you stop. Your success will have double being on you. Track of sales. Don't do a delivery and don't write on what you say. Because when you come back and you see the money in your possession, you have a team set, you can't eat it. You can't even keep track of your sales. Keep track of your sales, make you know what needs to be discontinued, what you need to start doing. Um, when you search for the no eater packet, don't eat your packet. Don't eat your packet. Like, when, when I sit down and I'm talking to someone who doesn't eat it every time, it's getting in my heart. Because for the week, what I eat, for the start of this, is no cap. No cap. Like, it could have started with that. Because at that time, the least me that eat is $1,000 and 1000 times 7 is $7,000 and over by a cosmetics bike, you can start your lift line for $1,500 but if you want, if you want like, that's what they think from scratch, but at 2 5 and 3 like, so look there, we could have started 2 instead, we could have started so 1 and 2 product with us from the eat at the time, so don't be your and last but not least, Learn as you do. Even though my tips are based on my experience, as you, my experience is not the same as you. You won't be the same as you. So you can learn as you do. It's not like, oh, this is what is supposed to happen and it must happen and it should happen. Just learn as you do. Every day you learn something. Every day. Every day I learn something. Every day people so surprise me. Every day I learn about how to make a new product. Every day. You just have to keep educating yourself all about so, with that being said, I hope this was helpful to aspire entrepreneurs or entrepreneurs that are feeling a bit discouraged at this time. Just watch over this video, um, follow some of the tips and just work on your business. Because at the end of the day, enough bread is there for everybody to have a life off of. That, that's just my mindset. Like anybody can get a chance to get that bread. We can have 10 hairdressers, but we'll have. Anybody can be So make sure that you follow my business page on Authentic and Nature by Kim. My personal page on underscore Kim Radio on underscore Cosmetics by Kim because on Cosmetics by Kim I really developed a passion to help entrepreneurs or aspiring entrepreneurs to start their business because a lot of people want to start a new class business and I've been doing it for approximately two years and I'm like I can help a person to start it because it's not that hard and it's not very expensive to start. So ensure that you follow up with the if you want to start your business, you know a friend that owns a friend that owns a friend that owns a friend that wants to start your business. Go ahead. You guys enjoy this video and I'm going to be more consistent and see the bullies. On the next stop, bully me on WhatsApp, Instagram. I'm going to start posting once a week. Once a week, like, may I promise you know, one day out of the week, and I think it will preferably be a Wednesday or a Sunday. So, ensure that you stay tuned, comment, like, subscribe, so you think about this video. Bye!